Hello, hello, you guys. Happy Tuesday. And welcome to today's afternoon class, which is pretty special because it's usually in the mornings. But this morning was a little crazy for me. So, we're getting in our workout now. Today, we are going to work on core, really strengthening that tummy. So, we'll flow it out, stretch it out, strengthen it up. We're gonna meet in the middle of the mat in Tadasana Mountain Pose. Bringing all four corners of the feet, tucking the hips, rolling the shoulders back, engaging the core with our crown connected to the cosmos above. Deep breaths here. Inhale, arms come overhead. Exhale, forward fold, Uttanasana. It's our first forward fold of the practice. So feel free to grab either elbow, bend the knees, take what you need. On your next breath, walk it out to downward facing dog, Adho Mukha Savasana. Deep breaths here, taking what you need, either moving organically or finding stillness. On your next breath brings you into upward facing dog, out of Urdhva Mudva Savasana. Hips are off of the mat, arms and legs engaged, heart is open. Exhale, send that pelvis back, Balasana, child's pose. Inhale to rise to a tabletop position. And from here, we're gonna breathe through a couple cat cows. Inhaling for cow. Exhaling for cat. On your next breath, come to a neutral spine tabletop position, and from here we're going to kick it out into plank pose. Not letting your hips drop, but engaging that core, pushing the earth away from you. Stay connected to your breath. <clears throat> Here we're going to come into side plank, right hand on the mat. Breathe it out. Exhale, return that hand to the mat. Deep breaths in center plank. And our next breath, come to your left hand, right hand in the air, side plank. Breathe it out here. Exhale, come back to that center plank pose. Inhale, upward facing dog. Take a breath. Exhale, pulse into the air, downward dog. Inhale, right leg comes into the air. Exhale, right foot steps between the hands. Inhale, rise to warrior one. Deep breaths here. All right, next breath, open your hips to the side of the mat, warrior two. One more breath here. Inhale, straighten the leg. Exhale, take tock your body to the right. Take a breath, side bend to the right, triangle pose. Breathe it out here. There's no weight in this lower hand. It's all core strength. On your next breath, hands come to either 
other side of the foot, right foot comes to meet the left, downward facing dog. Inhale, left foot comes into the air. Exhale, left foot steps between the hands. Inhale, rise to warrior one on the left side. Breathe it out here. Our next breath, open the hips, the side of the mat, warrior two. Inhale, straighten the left leg. Exhale, tick tock to your left side. Take a breath. Bend over into your left side triangle. Once again, using that core strength, no weight in this lower hand, breathe it out. Exhale, hands come to the mat, left foot comes to meet the right, downward dog. Take a breath here. And let your breath move you back into plank pose. From here, we're going to do 45 seconds of mountain climbers. So I'm going to say go, and we're just going to knee to chest, bust it out, and I'll say rest. Come back to downward facing dog. Here we go, mountain climbers. Downward dog. Whew, breathe it out. And next breath, come back into plank pose. From here, we're going to do 20 knee to the elbow. Bring the knee to the outside of the elbow. Switching out sides, we'll do 10 on each side. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Good job, downward dog. Take a breath. Exhale, knees to the mat. Grab a sip of water if you need it. And grab your weights because we're going to move into weight work. On your sit bones, with your legs bent in front of you, holding your weight at your chest, we're going to tilt back on the pelvis, enter into Vasana, really engaging that core. Breathe it out here. Take a breath, hold that weight over your head, engaging your whole back, your whole core, Continuing to breathe. Exhale, bring that weight back in front of your chest. And from here, we're gonna do 50 Russian twists. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, halfway there, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 10 more, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, good job. We'll come back to a seated position. Go ahead, stand up, holding your weight. And from here, we're gonna have the weight in the air and just do a standing crunch, bringing the weight to our knee. We'll do 10 on each side, here we go. One, two, 
three, really get that knee up there, four, really use that core, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, good job, switch it out, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, really crunch, nine, last one, ten, good job, Whew, take a breath, grab your other weight, and from here we're just going to do side add side dips, coming to the side, and back up, we'll do 25 on each side, here we go, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, Twenty-five. Switch it out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Ten more. Sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Good job. Ooh, from here, set those weights down. <sighs> Take a breath. Inhale, arms come overhead. Exhale, forward fold. Walk it out to downward facing dog. And walk your feet to your hands, just about, leave a little bit of room, widen your stance, and blow it up pelvis into yogi squat. From the front, we look like this. From here, we're gonna work on crow pose, which is an amazing core strengthener. So, what I want you to do, from yogi squat, put your hands on the ground, right in front of you. We're gonna raise the pelvis up, badoop, Knees are pretty much going into your armpits on the back side of your forearm. And if you've never gone into curl before, I just want you to raise one foot up, feel that strength, come back down. Raise the other foot up, come back down. If you're feeling a little bit stronger in your curl, place your knees up on your forearms, keeping your gaze up, not looking at the mat. Lift those toes and breathe. Exhale, come back down to the mat. Take a breath, sit bones on the mat. Soles of the feet together for butterfly pose. Come back to your breath. Maybe grab a sip of water if you need it. And from here, lower yourself down to the mat for recline butterfly. Interlacing the fingers behind the head. We're going to bust out 25 butterfly crunches. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Good job. Whew, straightening those legs, bringing my hands just under the booty or to the side of the hips. We're going to do 25 lower ab leg lifts. Bring legs into the air and back down. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, 
15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 25 more, 21, 22, 23, 24, last one, 25, good job. Come back down to the mat, Savasana. And on your next breath, inhale right into boat pose. From here, we're gonna bust out 15 boat crunches. Low boat, back to boat. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, whoo, 15, come to a seated position. Whew, take a breath. And from here, we're going to be in a plank pose on the elbows. Deep breaths here. From here, we're gonna do 20 hip dips. Hip to the side, back to center, hip to the side. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Hold it in plank. Walk your feet towards your elbows for puppy pose. And from here, bring your left foot into the air. Playing with that balance, maybe Getting close to headstand. Left foot back down to the mat. Right foot in the air, play around with it. Bring that foot back down to the mat. Come to your knees. Whew. I'm gonna show you guys a little prepping for headstand drill. Because headstand is a lot about back muscle, arm muscle, and core muscle. So, we're in dolphin pose. Bringing your head down, but not putting any weight on your neck. Basically creating a cage around your cervical spine and your skull with your forearms. So you're basically like this. Whew. And I just want you to kind of maybe jump up and then come back down. Jump and tuck, come back down. Jump and tuck, come back down. And it might start just looking like this, but eventually it's gonna look like this and like this. If you're already in your headstand practice or even handstand practice, play around here. Whew. When you're ready, come back down to the mat. We're gonna meet in a seated position. No savasana today. A little bit too worked up for that. Our hands come to heart center. The light, love, and divinity in me honors the light, love, and divinity in you. 